Okay, I just wanted to hop on here and make a real quick video uh, and let you know I had to mark all my videos private for a little while until I got got my zen back. Uh, that breeder I bought that puppy from got on her Facebook and was talking about we were not a good family and we sent that dog back because it didn't have a tail and so on. And then she started private messaging people that she saw me ask about their puppies. Bless her heart. But uh, that wasn't meant to be anyway, or it would have been. But that person that, that I know she did that with doesn't health test her puppies anyway. In, in fact, that breeder don't health test her puppies, the one that's been talking about me. She don't genetically test them either. I mean, I guess they're just hobby breeders. Like, I get yelled at for being by these doodle haters that don't know that I'm not a, I'm not a, a person that just breeds a couple of dogs and sells the puppies. I, I've been trying to test whatever I have to know if it's going to pass on illnesses. That's not why I'm making this video, though. Um, I'm going to get my channel going back up. I'm, here's what's happened since the last video I made. She's been doing all that, you know, with her Christian self stabbing me in the back. And then my very close family member passed away. And then uh, a couple days after that, uh, my son caught himself on fire and burned 68% of his body. And he's still in uh, a burn center in St. Louis, Missouri. And uh, I don't know when he's going to get to come home. He's got skin grafts going on. He's in a lot of pain. And he's starting to get, I, th I think he's starting to sleep a lot because he's not answering his phone now. But that happened. And then my family member that passed away, her mom's sister, passed away last night. So we've been a little bit busy. Um, I wanted to add... I've been talking to, I bet I've talked to 50 golden doodle breeders that will, will or will not sell me breeding rights to a puppy. And 100% of them said they have never heard of a golden doodle puppy or a golden doodle at all having no tail. So even though I knew I was right, that that puppy was an awesome puppy, except I could not use it for my breeder dog because the people would want to see the dad and the mom and the dad would have no tail and they would want that. A lot of people would want that on their puppy. So I was right. I thought I was. I don't want to be catty and I don't want to be rude. She accused me of being a mean person. But this mean person has not contacted anyone privately and told them anything about her or gotten on Facebook, which I am not on, and said anything about her. She's done that to me, and if that's a part of her therapy, that's awesome, you know. But I just wanted to tell you, this is what we've been dealing with. Uh, we've not been, you know, trying to see how much we can hurt a person that's already hurt, hurting, you know, right now, even though she didn't know that, because I'm not on social media to where I... Uh, try to drum up business and get on somebody on my bandwagon to make me feel better. That's, that's not me. That's why I'm not on Facebook. I hate Facebook because of that. But um, I want you to know that I lost someone very beautiful and precious to me. She was not my sister, but she might as well have been my sister. And I know she's in heaven, but I'm going to miss her. And uh, I'm going to help out with her kids and her husband. And uh, they'd be my brother and nephews. <sighs> Don't even seem real. But anyway, pray for my son. He's burnt. And uh, I know God's able. So that's all. I'm talking to breeders. I got a lot of really good news today from one lady in Gary, Indiana, that mentored me for over an hour. She didn't even know me. She told me I was right about everything. She told me things that I did not know about making sure that the puppies would have the perfect furnishings. 
She told me she's going to get a hold of Gana for me because she's kind of affiliated with the board and fast track me in because I'm going to pay my $100 membership and go ahead and get in there. I thought I had to wait till the girls were two, but I get to go ahead and get in there uh, now and get mentored by real dog breeders that really test their puppies and uh, really will sell you a health tested puppy because they know if you could prove that you're a uh, reputable, caring breeder of puppies and that they are not just something for you to make money on. They will work with you. They, they list you as a service dog provider, stuff like that. But I don't know when that, I don't know when the first litter of puppies will come. It may be next spring. I don't know. Cause I got a lot of work to do. I found out what, uh, I found out stuff that was just so good. And, and I had some to be hateful to me. Um, <laughs> one lady just started chewing me out I told her what had happened to me with this other puppy. And she said, you don't need to be telling people that when you want to call about breeding rights. You just need to be straightforward and say, can I have breeding rights? Because it makes you sound petty. And Gana is a low-life uh, piece of you-know-what uh, organization, and so is Embark, and so is Orivet. And I mean, I thought, what? That is that is who, how you find out about healthy dogs. This woman had lost her mind, but she was really chewing me out. But you know what? The Lord sent the next one by, and she was super sweet, and she talked to me for one hour. Shout out to Crystal. I've got her in my cell phone now, and i got a feeling we're going to be friends because I'm going to be contacting her. I'm going to get her address, and I'm going to send her a nice card, and send her and her husband a card to go out to dinner somewhere just because she was so good to me. It don't matter to me what the haters do. They they might hurt me for a little while, but God knows all about that too. And he also knows when his children are deliberately being cruel to other ones. And he's merciful enough to deal with it in the right way. So that's all I'm saying. I'm getting messages. I wasn't even going to make another video. This is seven minutes long. I want to say hey to Duncan. I've kind of been down and out for a little while. I, I mean, I was so tired with all this dog stuff. But now I'm about to put in two more weeks, and then one of my jobs will be done for several weeks, and I'll be off for the season, and then I'll only have three jobs, three that I am the one that uh, uh, is the owner, you know, so I can work for myself. <laughs> but anyway, thank you for listening to me. I didn't even want to get into this, but this is what it is. Um, I appreciate all of you. I had to mark my videos private just to get myself a breath of fresh air and a break. But I'm back at it. I'm back to studying, researching. I'm going to get a hold of Gana the first chance I get. It's probably going to be a couple of weeks when I get out of school because i got to fill out a whole lot of information. And i got to find out some things. But I think I can go ahead and do the girls' pin hip now according to that breeder, that breeder of mini golden doodles who gets like, she gets like $5,000 a puppy out of those minis, but I don't do minis. So, but I, my hat's off to her if she does. I'll talk to you all later. Be blessed. Bye.